15,205, we've got the case break of Series 210s. So I wish you guys all the best of luck. I really don't have a lot of room here. I'll put those back there for now. Adam Fox for the Rangers canvas. Kind of opposite normally how I open the packs, but award winners blue for the Oilers of Dre Seidel. Portraits rookies of Klejov for the San Jose Sharks. <laughs> Quinny for Vegas Young Guns. And by the way, I'm trying to think what else I can tell you guys on it. Rookie materials for the Blue Jackets of Foodie. Olafs and Dazzlers for the Buffalo Sabres. I can tell you by an actual retail value. The spot price is about 600 lower than it should be. Portraits of Lafreniere for the Rangers. So think about that. The spot price by retail is about 600 per spot lower. Nashville Predators, award winners of Yossi. Then I uh, should be doing it. So Retro marquee rookie of Alexiev for the Caps. And Jamie, how you doing, sir? And a gross young guns for the Coyotes. Mr. Jamie, Mr. Salesman. I'm happy more and more people, Jamie, as I said, I, I know me and you talked about this on email. I'm happy more and more people are realizing if you just be patient. Anyone who talks ill or down of it, they just don't know honestly. That's the honest, straight up answer on that. They just don't know. We've got a Makar Award winners for the Avalanche. Tavares Dazzlers for the Maple Leafs. It's always how it is, though. Radish Young Gun for the Rangers. Salesman. Hey, I'm happy you're making some sales. Young Guns Canvas of Hagel for the Hawks. You know what? As I said, people just blindly talk, and that's always what my issue is. It always frustrates me when people just blindly talk and they don't know. Marky Rookie for Nashville of Connor Ingram. Marky Rookie for the Vegas Golden Knights of Reed Duke. Jamie, are you okay uh, me letting people know what it's about? I don't think it really matters to you, but Mike Riley, Ottawa, Canvas. So others can uh, have opinions or at least hear the story. Young Guns for Tampa of Foot. Portraits for the Hawks of Hagel. And a marquee rookie for the Hawks event whistle. Yeah, go ahead. So basically, obviously, we're selling some consignment items for Jamie. And I advise him at the uh, expo, absolutely get the cards graded. It's going to increase your value and help you move them. Um, and obviously, he, uh, he listened, which we really appreciate. So he got the cards all graded by MNT. To give you guys perspective, and don't get me wrong, we're not oblivious either. Is of course you're gonna get the people sitting there going, oh, you're not gonna get the value, blah, 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 blah. So, anyways, I told him, don't worry, be patient, you'll get the value you want. David Kasha for the Flyers, Young Guns. One of the cards we sold recently, I think it was a Huberto, if I remember correctly. Huberto Future Watch Auto. So, the last PSA 9 and the last BGS 9. Marky Rookie for the Capitals of McMichael. Literally sold three days ago for like 202 and like 210 or something like that. It was crazy. Olafson Canvas for Buffalo. Well, we sold Jamie's for 230 US. His MNT9. Cowman Young Guns for the Sharks. So as I've always said, anyone who honestly says that you cannot sell it for more, they're just they spew wrong stuff. 
Young Guns for the Coyotes of Burke. You got to be patient. Now, the other one, a I think it was a Dre Seidel 99. Martin Nietzsche's Carolina Canvas. A Dre Seidel 99 Ice. Um, the most recent Marky Rookie for the Avalanche of Frank Hoos. And a Dazzler's Karusha for the Hawks. Was a Beckett 95. Sold about a month or so ago for $1,650. Kivaranta Portraits for the Dallas Stars. So it was a couple months ago, but sold for $1,650 for a 9.5 Beckett. We just sold his 9 Dre Seidel for $1,800. <laughs> MNT 9, $1,800. So $150 more than the 9.5. Now, don't get me wrong. Obviously, offers are one way to go. But as I've stated for many, many, many years, if people just be patient, you'll get what you want on your cards. Just don't rush things. And you'll get, you'll be happy with what you get. And as I said, and I still stand behind that, anytime we've ever sold an MNT card, award winners for the Ottawa Senators to Bobby Ryan, we almost always get the exact same if not more than what Beck and PSA asked. Well, he's gonna be patient. Canvas of Nylander for the Maple Leafs. So, I said, I'm happy to show those as proof. Young Guns for the Coyotes, of gross. The problem is, people always look at auctions and they only, only assess one auction. Sharon Govich for the Devils, Young Guns. And they take that as gospel. We've got a retired canvas, Bob Probert for the Red Wings. That's a cool one. Marky Rookie Blue for Florida, Prisky. And a Dazzlers of Ingram for the Preds. Portraits of Joseph Wool for the Maple Leafs. And a Hoaglander, Young Guns for Vancouver. And the good news is, is generally when you get any cards graded, you are increasing the value uh, generally pretty significantly for your card. Not that it makes a massive difference, Jamie, but the last 99 that went raw, which I think was about four months ago, went for, I think, just over a thousand bucks. So you're talking about roughly an $800 increase on that card alone for you, pretty much. Just to get it slabbed. Young Guns Canvas, Joseph Wall for the Maple Leafs. Uh, Dan sold that one. I think it was around like 250, 280 something Canadian all in. Marky Rookie Blue of Bowers for the Avalanche. But I believe we sold it in store. So I think there was no eBay fees, which I think is pretty damn good. Portraits for Philly of Ustamenko. Young Guns for the Sharks of Klejov. Hey, money is always good. Money is always good. As it's better to get your life, you know, organized, caught up, whatever it is. Cards can always, cards will always be there. Lawrence for Carolina. Fortress rookie. Award winners of Dre Seidel for the Oilers. Marky Rookie for Philly of Zamula. Monahan Dazzlers for Calgary. The Burroughs, I'm sorry, yeah. Radish Young Guns for the Rangers. Yeah, price, I think, was the uh, best offer. That's correct. I don't know who Dan sold to, but I'm guessing someone just offered off eBay and... I think it's I think it's a fair amount for what you also gotta remember, Jamie, of what the cards graded. Right? I always take that into factor. If you have like a nine, five, or ten, you don't necessarily need to rush it. But when you have a low grade, it's not bad just to get rid of it per se. We've got a canvas of McDavid for the Oilers. Marky Rookie of Karusha for the Hawks. Poor 
portrait of Vanasek for the Caps. Cousins, Young Guns for the Buffalo Sabres. Yeah, the PMG is like, I also think that's going to slow down, personally. The reason I do think it's going to slow down, realistically, is I feel like Upper Deck's going to put out a lot of PMGs over the coming years. Portrait of Robertson for the Leafs. And again, I don't think that's a bad thing. I just think it's going to naturally lower some of the older ones. Marky, rookie of Coughlin for Vegas. Award winners, Tampa Bay of Hedman. Dazzlers of Gibson for the Ducks. And a third cough for the Blue Jackets, young guns. Yeah, the investment, as I said, the honestly, in my opinion, the investment to get those cards graded, it's crazy good value. So here's another fun question. I had a good phone conversation today, guys. And I'm curious about your like straight up honest opinions because they wanted me to ask your guys' opinions as well. How much do you guys value it, the guarantee that they're doing now? Does that add a lot of value to you? No value, little value, don't care. And again, I'm I'm literally just gonna be relaying the messages. So Nashville Roman Yossi Award winners. In your honest opinion, and I would like as many people to answer as possible, Tampa Bay Lightning Award winners with their new guarantee, Cousins, second Cousins, for the Buffalo Sabres, Young Guns, Marner Canvas for the Maple Leafs, Marky Rookie Blue for Florida of Marshmint. And a Dazzlers of Ottinger for Dallas. Marky Rookie for Washington of McMichael. Oh, uh, so on their site now, Barkov Canvas for Florida. Uh, MNT starting February 1st is going to be changing up their system a bit. Cole Smith, Young Guns for Nashville. Essentially, they're introducing a guarantee timeline or money back. Portrait of Ottinger for Dallas. Well, here's the thing, Joseph. And, and this is just my personal opinion on that. Is that a bad thing if they get overlo overloaded and your order's free then? <laughs> like, it sounds... It sounds bad, but almost is that not almost a better option for people? I'm saying like I I would take if I sent in 30 cards, I would be happy if my order was for free. Because I know I'm gonna be making bank on when I sell them. Canvas of Barzel for the Islanders. Yeah, so they're changing their timeline, I think, for more realistic uh, timetables. Pinho, Young Guns for the Caps. I like it personally. As I, said, I know I've told you guys as a dealer. Portrait of Lafreniere for the Rangers. You would rather wait for a free grading. Coglin Vegas, Marky Ricky. But literally though, Dan, that's what I was thinking in my head. You're going to have people going, I almost hope they missed their timeline. Award winners of Dre Seidel, Retro for the Oilers. And a Jack... Hughes for the da da Dazzlers for the Devils. Portraits for Buffalo of Johansson. Like, realistically, you're either getting your order exactly on time, early, or it's free. Young Guns, Tim Stutzel. Young Guns, Ottawa, Stutzel. I do recommend getting that one graded. Yeah, and that's the thing, Dan. I agree. I think it's a win-win. I know they've already warned that the prices will be up slightly. That doesn't shock me anyways. I think the whole world's moving everything up. 
Marky rookie of Soderstrom for the Coyotes. But like in all honesty, I think that's a phenomenal move, and I, I don't see honestly any negatives. Don't get me wrong, I know we haven't even got the official pricing yet, but I can tell you, I know people are gonna complain about any pricing going up. They always do anyways. But I feel like that guarantee is gonna add that like the value to it. But I, I don't see any loss at all from a consumer standpoint or even a dealer standpoint. Canvas of Malkin for the Penguins. Well, realistically, the conversation I have with them, Dan, is essentially they're just making it more realistic timelines and guaranteeing it. Angelo Young Guns for the Penguins. Like, what they basically kind of told me is, like, they're moving their sixth day to a one-month type thing. So, portraits, rookies for Nashville of Ingram. So, why not just be, like, they're moving their one month roughly to that four month or whatever it was service. Award winners of Bobby Ryan for Ottawa. So realistically, they're they're just guaranteeing what they're doing now. Essentially, I think it's a, the best, better way. Award winners retro for Minnesota of Dumba, Dazzlers of Yossi for the Preds. They're faster and they're cheaper. Portraits for the Jackets of Kivlinix. The problem I will tell you though, in all honesty, Dan, that we deal with, Kivlinix for the Jackets, young guns, is the amount of times, and I can tell you this. Because I sit beside uh, Anna when she tells customers. Is even when she tells customers there's a delay, the amount of times they'll call us, like, really quickly after. Marky, rookie of Regula for the Hawks. Expecting, like, they'll be like, oh, I got a 30-day. And Anna literally has the same speech to everybody. It's 30 business days, doesn't include weekends or holidays. There's a two to five week delay, blah, 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 blah. They literally will call us almost a one month later, which is not 30 business days, and be like, is my cards almost done? So this, I think, will solve a lot of dealers' headaches of, you know, if you get the one month service, it'll be done in one month. Like, it's just a lot easier, no. And if they get it done earlier, earlier even better. Award winners for the Avalanche of Makar. Uh, Hoaglander, Young Gun for sure. Foot, Young Guns for Tampa. We've got a canvas for Philly of Konechny. As I said, I think they're making the right move on this. From a dealer standpoint and a consumer standpoint. Marky, Rookie Blue of Karusha for the Hawks. Shea Weber for the Habs Dazzlers. And I also think it is a very ballsy move for them to do, but kudos to them. Lucas Carlson, Portraits Rookies for the Hawks. Stone for Vegas, Canvas. Hoaglander, Young Guns for Vancouver. Portraits for Calgary of Zagadulin. Award winners for the Jets of Hellebuck. So I think we're going to find out pricing like, I think next week, roughly. By the sounds of it, so I can obviously update you guys. You pulled a McDavid auto? Awesome, Phil. Congrats. Oh, by the way, did uh, anyone who's watching yesterday, did Ashley uh, let you guys know what one of our members opened uh, in their in their pack? From a chancer. Yeah. We've got a marquee rookie for Dallas of Harley. I, I would presume Golden that they would, but I'm sure they'd also probably give it a much advanced notice. Soderstrom for the Coyotes, retro rookie. I don't know if I actually told you guys what someone got out of it. It's kind of cool. The third, Dylan Cousins, Young Guns for Buffalo. Canvas for LA of Dowdy. 
And judging by their uh, lack of response, I'm guessing not. Marky Rookie of Vanisic for the Caps. Either way, one of our members messaged us. Marky Rookie of Ustamenko for Philly. And this is why I always say, guys, in the chancers, don't get bummed out before you officially know what you've got. Like, I, I hate when people get bummed out on that stuff. Canvas of D'Angelo for the Rangers. In his allure pack, he got one of those uh, shields. I don't know what it was numbered to. Cole Smith, Young Guns for Nashville. Dazzlers of Tavares for the Leafs. Of McDavid. And I think it was one of the old shields, so it could be a low-numbered one. Portraits of McMichael for the Caps. So realistically, if that's like out of 17 or 45, that's probably a several hundred dollar card if I had to guess. So... I always say on those chancers, don't get bummed out if you get a pack. You never know what you're going to get in them. That obviously is uh, probably a, the case hit numbered card in that, uh, in Allure. Yeah. Makes me happy when I hear those things. And I appreciate you guys letting me know. Veg Demo, Young Guns for Montreal. Robertson Dazzlers for the Maple Leafs. Yeah, Huberto, eh? He's killing it. Portrait of Ottinger for Dallas. The problem is, honestly, Jamie on Huberto and Barkov, I don't think they'll ever get the hobby love. Marky, rookie of Skinner for Oilers. Just because they're in Florida. I really don't think they're ever going to get to, like, that upper echelon status. Marky, rookie of Karusha for the Hawks. Sad, he's their beast of a player. Morgan Geeky, Carolina, Portrait Rookies. Crawley, Young Guns for the Rangers. Like, if Huberto was on, like, the Leafs or the Montreal Canadiens or Oilers, this stuff would be crazy. I feel bad because certain players are just never going to get the love because of what team they're on. Marky Rookie of Zamula for Philly. I, I think he is definitely one of them. And a Mark Stone canvas for Vegas. I absolutely would agree with you. I would have him as one of the biggest underdogs. Or undervalued, sorry. Underrated. Bowen Byram. Gold for the Avalanche. Karusha for the Hawks. Soderstrom for the Coyotes. Lafreniere. Rangers. Ingram for the Preds. Gold of Karusha for the Hawks. Del Andrea for Dallas Gold. Karusha for the Hawks. Kraps of Gold for the Rangers. McMichael for the Caps Gold. Regular of McMichael. Harley Gold for the Dallas Stars. So I am praying that Shane Wright does not go to the Arizona Coyotes. Soderstrom for the Coyotes. Robertson Gold for the Leafs. Bowen Byram for the Avalanche. Soderstrom for the Coyotes. Robertson Gold for the Leafs. Byram for the Avalanche. I swear I just said that one. Robertson for the Leafs. Harley for the Stars. Byram Gold for the Avalanche. Della Andrea for the Dallas Stars. Gold of Soderstrom for the Coyotes. Robertson for the Maple Leafs. Glossy. Harley for Dallas. Byram Gold for the Avalanche. Karusha for the Hawks. Well, the my honest thing, Jamie. Gold of Lafreniere for the Rangers. Harley for Dallas. Byram Gold for the Avalanche. I think you'll probably sell the Barkov in the playoffs. Be our pricing obviously strategically. Soderstrom Coyotes. Robertson Gold. Bowen Byram for the Avalanche. We obviously price it pretty high. I think if they do any uh, good stuff in the playoffs, you'll sell it. Harley for Dallas. Del Andrea Gold for Dallas. Karusha for the Hawks. There she goes.